Let's see how to fix the Cyanolib better discard plugin not working. Whenever you face this kind of error, you see it's screen like this. Better discard is a popular modification for the discard app that allows the users to customize their discard experience with plugins and the themes. Xenolib is a plugin commonly used with better discard that provides the additional features and the functionality. However, sometimes users may encounter an issue where Xenolib is not working properly preventing them from using their favorite plugins. This can be frustrating for the users who rely on the Xenolib to enhance their Discord experience. So let's see how to fix the Xenolib better Discord plugin not working. The first method is update the better Discord. The first thing that you should do is to check if there is an update available for the better Discord. Open the Discord and go to the better Discord settings. Click on the update tab. If an update is available, click on the update to download and install it. The second method is disable other Discord plugins. Sometimes the Xenolib may not work properly if there are any other Discord plugins installed with that conflict with it. Try disabling the other plugins and see if the Xenolib works starts working properly. To disable the Discord plugins, you have to follow open the Discord and go to the plugin section. Disable any other plugin that may be causing the conflicts with the Xenolib. The third method is check if the Xenolib is compatible with your version of the better Discord. Make sure that the Xenolib is compatible with your version of the better Discord. If you are using the outdated version of the better Discord, Xenolib may not work properly. To check if the Xenolib is compatible with your version of the better Discord, you have to follow some of the steps. Go to the Xenolib website and check the compatibility information. If, if your version of the better Discord is outdated, update it to the latest version. The fourth method is reinstall the Xenolib if the other troubleshooting methods don't work for you. Try uninstalling, reinstalling the Xenolib. Open the Discord and go to the better Discord settings. Click on the plugins tab. Find the Xenolib in the list of the plugins and click on uninstall button. Download and install the latest version of the Xenolib from the official website. The fifth method is check if there are any conflicts with the other disk software. Sometimes the Xenolib may not work properly if there are any other conflicts with the other software installed on your system. Make sure that there are no conflicts with the other software and try disabling any software that may be causing the issue. Okay, in order to check the conflicts with the other software, check if there are any complex software installed on your computer, disable any software that may be causing the conflicts with the Xenolib. The sixth method is reset the better Discord settings. If none of the above solutions work, try resetting your better Discord settings. This will remove any corrupted files that may be causing the issue. Open the Discord and go to the better Discord settings. Click on the settings tab. Scroll down and check on the reset to default buttons. The seventh method is use a, disc, use a different version of the Xenolib. If you are still experiencing the issues with the Xenolib not working properly, try using the different version of the Xenolib. Sometimes the certain versions of the Xenolib may not work properly with your version of the better Discord. To use the different version of the Xenolib, you have to follow some of the steps. Go to the Xenolib website, download and download a different version of the Xenolib. Install the downloaded version of the Xenolib. Eighth method is disable the hardware acceleration in the Discord. Disabling the hardware acceleration in the Discord can help to fix the issue if the Xenolib is not working properly. Okay. Open the Discord and go to the user settings. Click on the appearance tab, toggle the switch next to the hardware acceleration to turn off. And the eighth method is contact the better Discord support team. If the other troubleshooting method didn't work for you, can contact the Discord support team for further assistance. Okay. So that's all about this. Thank you.